How to Fill a High Pressure Carbon Fiber Tank by Airhog. First, remove the cap. Make sure the tank o-ring is in place and flush. Screw in the valve. This should be done hand tight. All Airhog tanks come pre-lubed. No additional lubrication is needed. Screw the DIN on the supply line from the compressor into the tank valve. Again, this should be done hand tight. Be sure that both bleeds are closed by turning them clockwise. Open the tank valve by turning it counterclockwise. Turn the compressor on. Open the valve on the line by turning it counterclockwise. This method of filling the tanks will also work if there is already residual pressure in the tank. Observe the pressure on the tank valve gauge and the compressor gauge as they rise. Keep an eye on the gauges as the tank fills. This could take 15 to 40 minutes, depending on beginning tank pressure, size, and CFM output. Depending on your compressor, it may shut off at a certain pressure. If the compressor hasn't shut off after the tank pressure has reached about 5,000 psi, close the tank valve and shut the compressor off. Bleed the line pressure. Close the valve on your supply line to ensure that moisture will not accumulate. Unscrew and detach the DIN on the supply line. The tank will be warm to the touch. The pressure will drop as the tank cools and settle at around 4500 psi.